already know that Huawei is banned from using Google services which means their latest smartphones such as the Huawei Mate 30 Pro and even their upcoming flagship the Huawei P40 Pro won't have apps like Gmail, YouTube, Google Maps and most importantly the Play Store. Of course, some Huawei users have found a way to counter this ban which is to sideload these apps from third-party websites. Now for the first time, Google has come forward to address the Huawei ban and they are clearly warning users of Huawei phones to not sideload these Google apps because they can't confirm whether or not the app is real or has malware hidden inside. Here's what they said, sideloaded Google Apps will not work reliably because we do not allow these services to run on uncertified devices where security may be compromised. Sideloading Google's apps also carries a high risk of installing an app that has been altered or tampered with in ways that can compromise user security. You see Google puts the certified devices through its rigorous security checks or preloads them with Google Play Protect software, which can detect when hardware has been compromised. In Huawei's case, they can't do that because of the ban and they are saying there are significant chances that the security of the Huawei phone can be compromised easily so basically they are saying to not sideload the apps which also means do not buy their phones. It looks like Trump administration is doing everything they can to destroy Huawei and their latest plan is to force TSMC which is the world's biggest chipmaker who makes socks for Apple, Qualcomm and more from supplying smartphone chips to Huawei. Now you might be like, wait, isn't TSMC a Taiwanese company? Well, that's right but they use US made manufacturing equipment. So now, the US government has proposed a new rule where companies using American tech must seek license to sell to Huawei. TSMC is the main supplier for the Kirin chipsets so this is another major blow to Huawei. I mean if this comes through then it would be impossible for Huawei to make chipsets and intern smartphones because almost every production company in China uses the American-made machine in one way or another. If the Google ban didn't hurt them as much then this will surely be going to hurt their business because this would literally mean they can't make smartphones. We'll have to wait and see if this actually goes through because high level meeting is being held this week but if this goes through then it will also hurt the US because in the long run companies will try to avoid the US tech and will try to become independent which would drive the innovation away from the US and would benefit China. Subscribe now and press the bell icon so you never miss an update.